Hey guys, Dan here, and welcome back to Five Nights at Freddy's sister location, where, as always, this game contains loud noises, jump scares, and crazy scary animatronics. So if that's not your thing, please proceed with caution. Press start. So yeah, welcome back. You guys absolutely smashed it on the previous video. I'm so glad you enjoyed this because I thoroughly enjoy this game, and we actually made it through two nights. Two nights, which is crazy. We only died once, which is awesome. So let's go on to night three and see what happens. I am so Daddy ready just for this. Once let me go play with her. You can't so play with her. And shiny. Didn't you make her just for me? Oh, oh, that's weird. Made her just for you? For real? Okay, that's even more weird. Welcome so um, back oh, to hello. another pivotal night of your thriving new career, where hello. you get to really ask yourself, what am I doing with my life? Exactly. What would my friends say? And most importantly, will I ever see my family again? <laughs> we understand the stresses of a new job, and we're here for you. Thank you. To help you reach a more stable and relaxing frame of mind, we offer several musical selections to help make this elevator ride as relaxing and therapeutic as possible. Yeah. We offer contemporary jazz, classical, rainforest ambiance, as well as a wide selection of other choices. Using the keypad below, please type the first few letters of the musical selection you would prefer. I don't- I don't like this keypad. I've just realized- is the keypad's name Mike? Is that his name? <laughs> I thought that was my name. Anyway, um, we had a few different choices. We are not going to be able to have a choice whatsoever because- It we... seems you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what you were trying to type, and I will auto-correct it for you. What did he choose? Thank you for selecting. Casual bongo. <laughs> That's actually better than all of those suggestions. Now that your elevator experience yes. has been customized to your needs and you're thoroughly <laughs> relaxed, it's worth mentioning that due to your lackluster performance yesterday, your pay has been decreased by a substantial amount. What? Please enjoy the rest of your descent. Oh, okay. They, they decreased my pay because I wasn't very good. Last, I only died once. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I'm not even sure how much I was getting paid anyway. But I mean, Five Nights at Freddy's 1, you got paid like 100 bucks. Which was terrible, so my pay is even less now. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Night three. Let's do this. Here we go. I love the music, especially with the bongos. But the music in this game, the graphics in this game are incredible. Right. Due to unforeseen malfunctions from today's shows, your nightly duties will require you to perform maintenance that you may or may not be skilled enough to perform. Great. <laughs> it became necessary for technicians to attempt to disconnect Funtime Freddy's power module. However, they were unsuccessful. Oh. Allowing them to try again would be an inefficient path forward, as yes. we would need to allow six to eight weeks for recovery and physical therapy. What? You will need to reach the parts and service room on the other side of Funtime Auditorium to perform the procedure yourself. Okay. Let's check on Ballora first and make sure she's on her stage. <sighs> Ballora, really? So, did he just say Funtime Freddy? I swear he said Funtime Freddy. That's pretty cool. Right, Ballora. Oh, are you there? You're actually there? Great. It looks like everything is as it should be in Ballora Gallery. Good. Let's check on Funtime Foxy. Okay. It's important to make sure she's on her stage before entering. Of course. Right. Boom. Great. Not there. We're going to shock Great. you. It looks like everything is as oh. it should be in Funtime Auditorium. <laughs> it was there. There's no need <laughs> to check on Baby tonight. Please refrain from entering unauthorized areas. Okay. Proceed directly to Funtime Auditorium. Awesome. I am ready. So it says don't go there. I kind of want to, though. Um, what should we... Should we go? No, you know what? Let's just do as we're told for now. Let's go. Okay. Awesome. Let's go to the Funtime Ballora, Auditorium. Funtime Foxy is motion activated. For this reason, it's important to keep the room dark as to not accidentally activate her. Oh. You have been provided with a flash beacon. Use it if you need to get your bearings and to ensure you don't bump into anything. Okay. However, use it as sparingly as possible. Proceed forward to reach the parts and service room. Okay, so this is another part where we can get jump scared by something we can't even see. Great. Okay, so the flash beacon, I accidentally used it a moment ago, but let's see. It, that was terrible. What, why would I need that? It didn't even do anything. All right, let's try it again. Uh, boom. What? It, it flashes, like, down there. <laughs> How is that even helpful? This is not helpful whatsoever. <laughs> oh, 
was not expecting that. Oh my goodness. Let's um, let's try that again, shall we? Right, so just because he told me not to do it, I'm going to check on baby. Let's see what baby's got to say, because I know this vent is a lot easier. I do not know what happened with that flash thing, because it didn't, it didn't, it didn't flash up anything. <laughs> and then I got jump scared anyway, right. Baby, I'm here to take a look and, and see. Oh, I can go under here. Should I go under there again? No, I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I don't I don't want to. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, so he just repeated his instructions. And what he says was, Funtime Foxy is um, activated by motion. So you need to keep the room dark. But I'm pretty sure it was dark when they jump scared me earlier. So let's press space. Oh, it's down there. Wait a second. I still don't get this. I'm so confused. I can hear noises when I move, but that's literally it. There's like a door down there, but where else do I go? Do I just go slowly? I'm gonna listen. I'm gonna listen real close. Oh, there's shuffling. Okay. Oh, I, I think I get it. So I think what you need to do is not bump into Foxy, which is why the room is dark. So we need to use our ears and try and get through this room. It's going to be really tricky. Okay, well, I'm definitely further than I was before. Let's press space. Yeah, the door is definitely closer. Okay, I just need to listen for the shuffling and then get out of here. So listen carefully. There's the shuffling. Did you hear that? Did you hear the shuffling? Okay, let's see if we can get through this. It's so creepy. Flash! Did you see it? It was right there. They were right there. Okay, the door's pretty close, so it's definitely the shuffling. I just need to be very, very careful. <laughs> oh, that was creepy. Flash. Okay, we're so close. So, so close. I'm literally taking like two, maybe three steps at a time, but I'm making it. Uh-oh. 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 Did I do it? Yes! Parts and service. Great job reaching parts and service. No it problem. It seems that Funtime Freddy is out of power, which should make your job much easier. The release switch for the chest cavity is located on the underside of the endoskeleton jaw. Okay. To reach it, we will first need to open the face plates. You will need to press the face plate release triggers in a specific order, and it's important to be as precise and as careful as possible. Great. Locate the small button on Freddy's face, just under his right cheek, and press it. Just under his right cheek. So, um, this is, uh, fun time Freddy, everyone. Have we met him before? I'm not 100% sure. I'm pretty sure not, but he's got, like, a little bonnie on his hand, which is awesome, and a microphone in his other. I like the new color scheme, Freddy. Very cool. So, a little button under his right cheek. This one? Oh. Great. Now yes. locate the button under his left cheek and press it. Okay. This is gonna... <laughs> so, if you do this wrong, he's literally gonna launch at me. So, left cheek, be accurate, and press it. Great. Now carefully locate and press the button next to Freddy's right eye. Oh, I can see it. Oh, it's right here. They're like little bubbles almost. Please don't get me. Please don't get me. I need to get it really accurate. Great. Yes. Now carefully locate and press the button just above Freddy's nose. Just above Freddy's nose. Right here. Oh, click. Ah! Why? Why, 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 why? The face plates should why? now be open. Locate and press the small button on the underside of Freddy's endoskeleton jaw. Okay. I was listening! The underside of his exoskeleton jaw? That was not fair. That was really not fair, buddy. Oh my goodness. Um, underside the right... Oh, I don't know. There's so many! I'm gonna go here. Ha! Huh! I missed. Okay, it wasn't that. Was it this? It wasn't that? Good job. Oh, yes. The faceplates should now be open. Locate Great. and press the small button on the underside of Freddy's endoskeleton jaw. On the underside of Freddy's exoskeleton jaw. Um, where is it? Where is it? It's just one of these? Really? Is it this one here? Let's see this one. Ah! <laughs> Excellent. The chest cavity should oh now be goodness. open. Oh my goodness. Remove the power module from the chest cavity. Okay. Uh, this is cool. This is like operating on Funtime Freddy. <laughs> oh, every time you do it right, it scares you. I thought every time you do it wrong, it would be scaring you. Okay, it probably does both. Okay, we need to remove the power module. I'm going to click this red button here. Um, go! Great work. Woo! You will now be required to remove the secondary power module from the Bonnie hand puppet. Okay. Press the large oh. black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. Uh, 
Wait, wait a second. Um, it's not there. It's uh, it's it's not there. <laughs> oh, hello. Oh, great. Fantastic. So under Bonnie's bow tie. Bonnie, will you stop messing around, please? Bonnie, please. Are you gonna, are you gonna come out now down here now? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Bonnie's bow tie. I'm pretty sure he said. Um, where are you now? Bonnie, this is not a game. Stop it. But it's not showing Bonnie's bow tie. It's just kind of jumping around all over the place. Ah, oh, Bonnie! Will you behave yourself? Bonnie, will you behave yourself? I can't get your bow tie if you're just not showing it, to be honest, can I? Should I just click Bonnie and see what happens? Bonnie. Bonnie, this is not a game. This is not a, a game. Where are you? <laughs> ah! Bonnie. Bonnie, that just- that just wasn't fair. I mean, come on, Bonnie. You were just hiding your bow tie, waiting to scare me. Thanks a lot, Bonnie. My goodness. <laughs> this is so many jump scares in this. It's- No! You can't do this to me. You cannot do this to me. It sends me all the way back here. I have to do this bit again? What? Oh, jeez. Okay, so I'm on the power module bit again, and I see you. So we need to press this black button here when that disappears. So let's grab this real quick and snap. Great work. Yeah. You will now be required to remove the secondary power module from the Bonnie hand puppet. You're gone already. Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. Okay, so I couldn't recognize a, um, a pattern at all of how Bonnie um, appears. But let's just wait and see, I guess, because we need we need them to reveal the black button. Oh, where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Okay, so is it moving? Oh, it's moving. Okay, so Bonnie is up there. The button is exposed. Okay, it moves up. But I need to catch this really, really quickly. No, I missed. Duh! Okay, it's back. It's back. I don't know how far I can go. But I need to wait for the button. I need to be precise. There's the button. There is the button. Bam! Yes! Great job. Oh. You've acquired both power modules. Yes! This completes your tasks for the night. Woo, Please exit tense. the building through Funtime Auditorium. And we'll see you back here again tomorrow. Great, great news. Okay, so um, nice talking to you. Nice seeing your innards. That is creepy. Uh, successful operation, I think you'll find. Oh, that was that was pretty hard to work out, but we need to go back through here. Fantastic. Okay, let's um, let's listen cuz I, I do not want to fail this and have to do that again. Let's listen. Are you there? You're not there. Okay, uh, it, it seems like this is harder on the way back. <laughs> okay, we're still pretty far away. I'm being so so nervous of this. It's unreal. I really don't want to do that body bit again. <laughs> uh oh no! I got caught! I got caught. Oh, it's so difficult on the way back. Don't make me do the whole thing again. Daddy, she can make balloons. What? Have you seen her make balloons? No. Oh, Daddy, let me go to her. No. Don't go. Did I still pass it? Wait a second. Shh. Wh be still and quiet. Okay. You've been sleeping for quite a while. I think they noticed that you never left the building last night. The uh, cameras were searching for you, but they couldn't find you. Okay. I have you hidden too well. What? I kidnapped you. What's that? Night Oh, we're straight into night four. Okay, we were supposed to get caught. Okay, that, that's good. <laughs> oh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Right, so um, I guess that ends the second part of Five Nights at Freddy's sister location. My goodness, that was tense. That was so, so tense. So um, I'm planning on doing this a lot more often if you guys like it. So if we could get a ton of likes on this video, I will definitely upload another part tomorrow because I definitely want to find out what on earth is happening in this crazy animatronic suit. Woo! This game is so awesome. We operated on Funtime Freddy. 
How cool is that? But anyway, if you did enjoy this and would like to see some more tomorrow, please do a big fat like. That would be greatly appreciated. And if this happens to be the first video you see by me, please do consider subscribing to join Team TDM today for daily gameplay videos. Apart from that, thank you so much for watching. You are the best. Have an amazing day, and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye!